Hey guys, what's up? I I'm here to give you guys a recap on the new chapter of One Piece, which is on chapter 989. Now, this chapter right here, it was pretty fun, goofy, and that ending, I'm so excited, and I can't wait for this, for the upcoming battles or fights to come, man. I mean, like, um, oh man, I can't wait. <laughs> so, if anything else, let's just get this started. We have to it that um, the chat the first the cover page of One P One Piece chapter nine hundred eighty nine shows Pound showing proof that he is actually the father of of the child of the two children you know you no know, Chiffon and Lola but aside from that um yeah anyways um we have to it that um Frankie and the others show up in the nick of time to like stop Big Mom from rampaging and you know we have to it that Yamato's like hey I am Odin I will protect you but he goes like hey why are you running away from me because they all scare him wondering what the hell are you kind of thing you know and <clears throat> we have to it that Big Mom is really ticked off and says man you guys come in one after another man you are so annoying everyone else is like okay we gotta get the hell out of here and we're gonna be dragged to hell because of her and we have to that Hyogoro and his other subordinates end up saying, Hey, we have... Right now, with these guys right here, we have to deal with them or slow them down at least for the most... Of, as, as most of the times. While, like, um... While we see to it, we see another scene where, like, um... Big Mom says, Oh, long time no see, Soul King. You really got some nice people here. He goes like, Oh, you got a sharp eye. Do you like that iron body you have? And... And we have to it that Frankie tells Big Mom, Hey, I'm Frankie the Cyborg. And <laughs> and we have to it that Nami tries to tell like um, Frankie, Oh, you gotta get the hell out of here. She's a Yonko. He goes like, Who the hell is that? <laughs> and sorry, Frankie's not afraid because he goes like, Aren't we gonna make our captain the Pirate King? He goes like, Radical. And then all of a sudden, all of a sudden, he was about to make a blast. But unfortunately, we have to it that the numbers, which is shown in this chapter, they're... We have to it that like the numbers show up and realizes that they, that Frankie says, "Hey, those three creatures remind me of freaking Thriller Bark or something." Even Big Mom says, "Oh, so that's them, the failed ancient giants." Not to mention, Kaido got them from Punk Hazard, you know. And we have to it that Frankie realizes that he that they are holding the Brachio tank, you know. This upsets Frankie so much, he goes like, Hey, give him back, you stupid big mole. Radical beam. He ends up blasting the giant... He ends up blasting the freaking punk hazard creature or something. And we have to it that Big Mom's like, Hey, Iron Man, you think it's wise to shoot them instead of me? And we have to it Frank was about to get hit by Big Mom. But Jinbei shows up asking Robin for help at the beginning of the chapter. He ends up flipping Big Mom along with... Robin having to use her devil fruit ability to whirl to roll her away, which is really hilarious. And Big Mom's like, "You, Jinbei, you punk! How dare you abandon my crew? You will pay for your life." And, and Jinbei's like, "Oh, go, go ahead, do your worst. You think I care? You think I care right now?" <laughs> and we had to it that Nico Robin rolls Big Mom away, and it was so hilarious to go, like, "Oh no, anything but that." And then Robin's like. How's that gonna help? And Jimbo's like, <laughs> couldn't ask for anything better. Thank you very much. And we have to it. Everyone's like, hey, what's Jimbe doing here, you know? And Frankie tells Usopp and Chopper, hurry up and wake up. We're gonna fuse. He goes like, oh, yeah. Oh, that's exciting. And Queen's like, hey, what the hell's going on here? He ends up looking on at Straw, Straw Hat Luffy. And then we have to it. Zoro's like, hey, where are you going, Luffy? He goes like, yeah, to where Kaido is, up in the sky. And Zoro's like, all right, I'll tag along then. And they end up launching themselves up into the sky. But unfortunately, Queen shows up, transforming into his brachial source form. Stops Luffy and Zoro goes at A. I don't remember saying that I'm going to let you do whatever the hell you want. You hear me? And we have to it that King shows up with his um other crew members of guarding the sky. And Zoro and Luffy's like, oh man, are you kidding me? What the hell are they doing here? We can't even get through. And they end up being thrown to the ground, of course. And... We have to it that Sanji is actually uh, actually okay after King's attack and goes like, dude, this durability of this suit really ticks me off. Why the hell is it so strong kind of thing, you know? But that aside, um, 
we have to it that the chapter ends off with the Big Bang Hill Girl scene like um, the Straw Hat crew, you know, it was really, really awesome, man. I mean, that ending of a chapter where all Straw Hat crew members are right there, that just got me excited. I mean, like, um, let's think about it, okay? It's been so long. How many years has it been since they've been together one whole crew, you know? I mean... They separate in the Whole Cake Island arc and the Dress Rosa arc, Zoe, all kinds of things. And just seeing them all together with their newest member, Jinbei, man, it, it just brings me excitement and happiness in my heart, man. It's just been so long since I've seen them together, you know, and I can't wait to see all of them in action and seeing how it's going to go. And I'm looking forward to see, seeing what, where this is going to go. Aside from that, Luffy tells everyone, I'm going to go kick down Kaido. You guys, I know you can handle the rest. While everyone gets ready to like clash against the entire the, the Straw Hat crew and the others, this is going to be exciting. I can't wait to see Luffy in action with his new Bushishoku hockey technique. I mean, like um, the fact that he managed to like, get strong and train, train that ability, I wonder how much how good he could do against Kaido, against his freaking invuln invulnerability form, you know? But that aside, looking forward to the next chapter. So until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time. All right, peace out. Bye bye. Toot toot.